Good morning, fifth graders, or afternoon, or whatever time of day it is you're watching this. This is Hataru Koi on the trumpet. Um, I'm just going to start at the beginning, and I'm going to play down to letter B. That's about halfway through, where it says percussion interlude, okay? Remember, Hataru Koi only uses four notes. You need your F, you need C, and there are two Gs. Pretty easy, right? The only thing weird about Hataru Koi, before you start, I want you to try it with me. There is an E flat. Remember that second and third finger, the two furthest away from your mouthpiece. It should sound like this if you want to try it with me. This is E flat. Okay, so second and third finger. That's why that E has the little flat in front of it. This is how Hataru Koi goes. If you want to play along with me, that would be awesome. So we have two measures at the beginning. I will count the rest in between the notes too. So here we go. We have one, two, three, four, two, two. Ready? Here we go. Rest and rest. Rest and rest. Rest and. Here, C. Letter A, F. Rest and rest. Rest and rest. Rest, rest. There's potential to repeat that stuff that also happens again later down at the end where you have the coda, but everything is literally the same thing, just two times. So that is Hataru Koi on the trumpet. Here again, if you're on using this on YouTube, you can use the YouTube to slow this down. You just have to go down to settings, click playback speed and put 0.75, might be a little slower if you need to go a little bit slower the first time or two. But those are the four notes we need on Hataru Koi. Happy practicing.